Hey guys, what is up? Red Panda Mining here. How are you guys all doing? I hope you're all doing really well and having a great day. In this video, we're going to be testing out a Zotac P102-100 mining specific card. Okay, so we're going to get the hash rates of a bunch of different coins here. And this is what it looks like. It doesn't have any IO ports or anything because this is a mining specific card from Zotac. So we're going to get some different hash rates here of different coins from like Ethereum, Ravencoin, Vertcoin, Aeon, uh, Ciro, Bitcoin Gold, Rio or Ryo, uh, Grin29, Beam, Aeternity, Swap, Zellcash, Zcoin, and Bitem. Okay, <laughs> a lot of different coins here. And I want to thank Boris, one of my Discord mods, for letting me remote into his rig here and test out this card specifically. I've never played around with a P102, so this is going to be pretty fun. But I've already gone ahead and got the stock hash rates, as you guys can see. And if you guys don't want to watch the rest of the video, feel free to look in the description, and I have all of the hash rates and everything there already. And uh, feel free to hit the like button on the way out before you go. So thanks for watching. Stick around if you want to see all of the hash rates for the 70% power limit, okay? Actually, sorry. 73% power limit. Uh, so this is what the best power limit number is for this P102 that I've been doing testing with plus 100 core and then plus 550 memory. Okay, I've already got the stock numbers and now we're going to go through and get the uh, overclock one setting hash rates here. Okay? So let's go ahead and start the batch file for Claymore. 15 so we're going to be doing ethereum I'm using Claymore 15 and by the way we're using dash strap 4 so apparently this is the best strap for the for mining ethereum on a p102-100 okay and at plus 100 core plus 550 memory 73 percent power limit we are going to get 54.3 hash at 183 watts pretty good pretty good that is wow that is actually really good this card's pretty efficient i forgot to mention that this card has five gigabytes of gddr5x micron memory okay i know that this card is able to be bios modded to 10 gigabytes apparently but we don't have the bios mod or the bios file for the zo for the p102 100 uh to unlock it to 10 gigabytes but maybe one day if we get that file, I will make another video for you guys. And apparently we might be able to get higher hash rates once we unlock it. So, uh, but I'll keep, I'll keep you guys updated. So for now, we're just, gonna, we're, we're only going to be able to do the five gigabyte version. Okay. Now the next coin guys is Raven coin, which I already went ahead and did, um, because I did one hour average. So stock, we're able to get 30 mega hash at about 248 Watts. And, uh, at overclock one, we're able to get 36.06 mega hash at 180 watts. So pretty, pretty good, pretty, pretty powerful card, little card. I think this P102 100 is 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 basically compared to a GTX 1080 Ti, I believe. Obviously, not the same memory, not the same memory requirement, but it has the same RAM as a uh, 1080 Ti. Okay, so now we're going to do Vertcoin, my friends. So Vertcoin, we're able to get stock 48.04 mega hash at 250 watts. Now, at uh, overclock 1, we are getting 46.49 mega hash. So 46.49 mega hash at, uh, let's see here. I'm going to assume, yeah, 180, 170, 180 watts. Yeah, 180 watts. Okay, so that's Vertcoin. We're going to keep going real fast here throughout the other coins. Now, Aeon. We're going to be using G Miner. So at 73 power limit, we are getting... Uh, initially, we got 330 souls at 249 watts. Now, overclock one setting, we are getting 327 souls at 182 watts. 327 souls at 182 watts. Wow, pretty good, pretty good. Okay, now we're gonna do zero, and that is using NB Miner. Uh, let's open it up here, zero. And so overclock one, we are able to get, uh, this is ProgPow al algorithm by the way, so 23.05 mega hash at 248 watts. 
And now with the overclock one setting, we are going to get about 18. 18 mega hash, 18 mega hash at one, yeah, 180 watts. Pretty much the same. Okay, good old Ciro on ProgPow on NB Minor. Okay, so that's ProgPow, my friends. Uh, next one we're gonna do is Bitcoin Gold. So Bitcoin Gold, we're gonna be using G Minor. Uh, let's see here, BTG. So initially we were able to get 83.8 souls per second at 247 watts. 74.2 souls, 74.2 souls at 179 watts. Not too shabby. Okay, next coin, we're gonna do Ryo or Rio. I'm sorry if I, I keep butchering your guys' name. Uh, so let's do Ryo here. We're gonna see here stock, we're able to get 1,900 1991 hashes per second at 248 watts and here we are going to get 1736 hashes per second at uh, 180 watts yeah that's that's about the same as the other ones okay so that's Ryo let's close that and now let's do Grin 29 so we're gonna be using NB minor Let's do that one, NB minor. Okay, so stock on Grin 29, we're able to get 7.62 graphs per second at 248 watts. And now with overclock one, we are getting 7.32 graphs per second at 167 watts. We're getting some major share rejection here, but that's just the hash rate number for NB minor. Okay, next coin we're going to do Beam. This is one of the profitable coins I believe for NVIDIA right now. So uh, this should be pretty good. So stock we're getting 51.8 souls at 245 watts. Now on the P102 at 73 power limit we are getting 46.6 souls per second at 178 watts. Ah, so yeah, we've definitely got a better efficiency with uh, 73 power limit. Okay, uh, next one we're going to do AE Eternity. We're going to keep going here, guys. Just going to keep going down the list real fast here. Get you guys these numbers. And uh, stock, we're getting 6.47 grass per second at 215 watts. And then at the 73 power limit, we will be getting... 6.1 graphs per second at 164 watts. At 60, 164 watts. So pretty good. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, so that is a eternity, my friends. Next coin we're gonna do is swap using G minor. And initially we we're getting 6.15 at 216 watts. Uh, so now with swap 73 power limit, we are gonna be getting. 5.9 graphs per second. 5.9 graphs per second at 167 watts. Not too shabby. Okay, next coin, G minor. Three more coins, guys. Three more coins. Uh, G minor using Zellcash. So let's go here. Here it is. And initially we're getting 45.5 souls per second at 248 watts. And now overclock one setting, we are getting. 46.5, 46.5 souls at 182 watts. Okay, so that's Zellcash for you Zellcash lovers out there. Uh, next up, we're going to be doing Zcoin and Bitem. So we're going to be using T-Rex Miner for that one. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so with Zcoin, uh, we're using the T-Rex Miner, the web page, the web-based version, uh, we can see here we're getting about three, uh, 2.9 mega hash at about 166 watts. So that's the Z coin hash right there, 2.9 mega hash at 166 watts. Okay, next up we're going to be doing Bitem, so I'm going to let this run for a little bit. Okay, so with Bitem stock we're getting 3400 hashes per second at 249 watts, and now with uh, Bitem with 73% power limit we are getting about 3,250 hashes at 162 watts. Okay, wow. 
I don't, I'm not sure if some of you mind bite them, but uh, 3250 hashes, that sounds like a lot. Uh, I definitely haven't mind bite them before. 162 watts. Okay. Alright guys, so that is all of the hash rates for this Zotac P102-100 mining specific card. And uh, let's just see here, um, all of these hash rates, uh, they're, they're all in the description below. And I did do a what to mine previously, and I'm thinking that this coin, uh, this video card is actually profitable with just Ethereum at the moment, okay? So because of that, we're able to get about 54.3 mega hash at about 183 watts. Uh, that, is, that is the profitable coin on this card at the moment as of making this video. But that could change, obviously, because this, this video card can do a lot of core algorithms uh, very well. All these Beam, you know, Swap, Zcoin, all these other ones as well. Anyways guys, let me know what you think. I appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you Boris yet again for letting me remote into this rig to get the hash rates of this beautiful card. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one and peace out.